even when standing free, while the support plate with the caster, lower right, lies on the guiding rail of the jig supports and guides the pliers from the rear. Both the guiding insert and the support plate maintain the movable pressure jaws of the pliers in perfect register with the workpiece, so that the pliers only have to be advanced manually, but without further guidance. And that is why this ingeniously simple principle eliminates the need for time-consuming operator training. Further advantages are the low weight of the tool, its quiet operation, and the low call for or even total absence of subsequent finishing operations. It goes without saying that the clamps at the corners of the frame are hinged to avoid the need for opening them during seam closing. The clinching operation can proceed without interruption. Just think of the conventional method of seam closing with pneumatic tools. It is both time consuming and noisy. The tools and support frames are subject to considerable wear and tear. A lot of finishing is required and the work has to be carried out by highly skilled operators. The typical Eckold solution came just in time. Using Eckold seam closing techniques, small to medium production runs no longer require expensive press tools, and they are a guarantee of consistent quality level. This means that quality is no longer dependent on the skill of your personnel. The restricted guidance of the seam closing tool in the jig enables straight or even tightly curved parts, joggles and highly complex workpieces to be clinched. The feed speed amounts to a maximum of 10 to 15 millimeters per stroke. The sheet edges can be pre-folded between 10 degrees and 115 degrees and the flange heights can measure from 8 to 15 millimeters on a sheet thickness of 0.5 to 1.5 millimeters. This results in a surface quality like that obtained by manufacturing with press tools with the added advantage of high part repeat.